vision be my holy truth Yeah, I'll be the branches if you'll be the root I'd give all my freedom, I'd become a slave To lay on your shore and be washed by your waves To lay on your shore and be washed by your waves You stir the joy of letting go Yeah, I found my peace I found my hope I found my home Yeah, all I want is you, you know You stir the joy of letting go Yeah, I found my peace I found my hope, I found my home treasure, Lord, be my reward. Be my holy Jesus, what I'm fighting for. I'd give all my history just to stand at your door. To knock and hear, enter, you're an orphan no more. To knock and Coatesville was like one of the most important weeks in my life. Um, I came for the first time two years ago and it's really where I recommitted my life to God. Um, I got baptized two years ago and it was just the most peace I've ever felt in my life. And this week has just been amazing to me being able to relive that best week of my life where I, I came as one person and I left another. And I'm just so thankful to God that he gave me that experience and that he just keeps working in me. I think Coatesville is really just the most important thing that's been in my high school years because I came for like Coatesville the week after freshman year and I had no idea what the next three years of high school were going to be for me and now I've just finished my last Coatesville and I'm off to college and I have no idea what's in store for me but I know that like through this week I've learned that God's just going to be there for me and as long as I seek Him with all my heart, I'm going to be prepared for whatever is coming next. And just like I didn't know it was coming after ninth grade, I don't know what's coming now, but I know that when He's on my side it'll be good. I would just say that like, Kutzel is very special because, um, I think Pastor Mike talks about this, but like it's cool because we're like actually serving like we're actually it's like a it's a it's a retreat and a, like a mission thing is kind of combined but like every day we're kind of we're serving we're not doing stuff just for ourselves and i think that's something very big because like it's it's hard to like live a meaningful fulfilling life when you're only living for yourself and like it's very easy just to do only things for yourself but here we get come and we just get to serve 
and we get to be happy while we're serving and like just give of ourselves and I think it's really cool and special. Coatesville is just a place of comfort and a place of peace for me and um, a huge part of that is just being, being able to spend time with my friends and just disconnecting from the crazy world that we live in and um, I'm just really blessed by this place and um, just everything that it's done for me. Coatesville, when you come here, it's a time to get away. It's a time for you to learn and to be with the Lord. It's a time for you to get away from all the distractions. It's the chapels that really make it. You know, the worship time, it's unbelievably great. You know, you come in here with, you know, you, your mind is open. You know, the Lord tells us to come to Him with your heart prepared. And here, that's what we do. When we go into church anywhere else, you know, we're always surrounded by our distractions, by our phone, our technology. It's it's not a bad thing, but it definitely distracts us. Here, there's none of that, and it's awesome for us to go and worship the Lord and learn about Him when our heart is fully prepared for Him. I'm going to miss this. I'm sad that I won't be able to come back as like a kid or a camper or whatever. Um, but just a huge thank you to all of our leaders and staff, because you guys have been such a blessing in my life these past couple of years. Lately in my Christian walk, I... I just felt a little unmotivated. I just felt just so my my life felt so repetitive. It, I mean, I I just really needed this. I mean, this last day was kind of emotional for me. But uh, no, hopefully I'm just ready to go back home tomorrow. And I just hope that I stay motivated. I just hope that everything that happened here don't fade away. And I just hope I keep praying and um. Getting closer and closer to the Lord. <laughs> I've loved each year that I've had the opportunity to come because each year I can like see something very specific that the Lord has done in my life. Like freshman year I got baptized. Sophomore year was like difficult in like the summer, but the Lord like really was there with me through it and this year like he really I came into the week very like almost like cold to God and coming out of it like he softened my heart so much because he knew that's what I needed and I think it's just like being taken away from everything that we are so used to in our everyday lives um it forces us to really like see the Lord and serve him and others and that's what Mike says like we're here to serve him and others not ourselves and I think that's really fulfilling and that's why I really like it. Take me to the church and I'll pray, I'll pray. Take me to the river and I'll wash my sins away. Take me to the church and I'll pray, I'll pray. Take me to the river and I'll wash my sins away. Yeah, I'll dance in the water there I'll hardly come up for air Cause in the waters of new life I'm found And all the world is right to seek the Lord and he ministers to us here 
And it's just really special to see that in the lives of my friends and in my own life, just the ways I've been taught and refined here um, has been very special. My favorite part out of Kids Cape is the chapels just because we can um, feel God's spirit in that chapel and we get to worship and um, pray for each other and that's just a really great thing to have. I think at Coatesville the past um, three years that I've been here, I think the thing that the Lord has taught me the most is that in how in Ephesians 3.20 it says that he's able to give far more abundantly all that we ask or think and I think that just coming to Coatesville like God has always far exceeded my expectations of what he is able to do both like in me and like also through me to other people and it just taught me how to um, just serve him and expect great things from God because he's able to give them. So far But in the promise of your light I'm found and all the world is right This world, there's nothing I'll bring but a whispered hallelujah as I hear the angels sing. Sing, yeah, I'll stand with you in the end. I'll hear you call me your friend. Cause where my faith becomes my sight, I'm found, and all the world is right.